today's practice, Mike, a, a good step you talked about skating and, and getting speed back. Is that just one step at a time, literally? Well, we, we obviously think we need it. Uh, you know, over the last 20 days, I think we had 11 games or whatever. We didn't, we pra we kept the motor running. We didn't practice, and so um, you know, today was an opportunity to flush it out. We basically got an off day. I mean, we got the Gardner Classic tomorrow, but it's basically an off day tomorrow. So. Um, should be fun, and uh, this gave us a chance to get going. Yeah, at first, to be honest with you, I thought it was just a veteran move, get off the ice, had <laughs> enough skating, and, and, but I didn't realize now he's cut and he's got to drive all over town to get someone up, so bummer for him, but he's all right. Well, I think it's uh, I think it's important he said it. Uh, you know, all you got to do is look at Tavares and Marlowe, and they set a standard here uh, of excellence. I think it's pretty uh, good group to to follow. We got a lot of determined guys on our team. That's what we've tried to do over the last four years is is get really quality people that want to be great. And I think when you have that in your group, it makes it easier. Jansen said that his confidence has just grown tenfold since the start of the year. Where do you see that most in his game? Well, I mean, number one, he's got some speed back in his game, and uh, when he gets the puck, he wants to have the puck and uh, feels a little better about himself. Uh, the league's not easy. It's hard on people, and, you know, you, you win the championship the year before, you probably have a good summer and enjoy it, and then you come back and you find out everyone else has been working all that. So, um, you know, I don't know exactly the reason, but obviously he's going in the right direction, and, you know, I thought that gave us a, a good line last night. Um, I had Marlo on that line here today and him with Naz, but uh, you know, there'll be an opportunity either way. Hey Mike, uh, you set the team record for Marley's wins last night. How difficult is it at the A level to develop and win simultaneously? Well, I mean, the, the organization's really got to help you. I mean, obviously he's a good coach and done a real nice job, but the organization's got to commit to putting veterans in there, and that's money. You know, and because you can't do it without those guys to help you, but he's done a real nice job down there. I think uh, we're committed here in Toronto to having a real good program in the minors. We think it's uh, it's absolutely important to develop these guys and, and get the guys to be ready when they arrive. Um, so to be able to do both is excellent. Uh, they've had a good team ever since I've been here. This is the toughest start they've had. And they had injuries in net and stuff like that. But uh, obviously he does a good job and he should be proud. Uh, anytime you set any kind of record, you've done something well. Yeah, you'll have next time you play a game, you'll know whether or not you have Willie or, or not. Is there a, do you feel like there's a sense of anticipation amongst the group with just what's going to happen, just a finality to it? <laughs> this, is my, this is my favorite question every day. Um, you know, I, uh, I'll tell you again, this is what I think, and it's just what I, I think. Uh, Kyle and I talk about this every day, so I'm up to date on what's going on. Um, there's lots of opinion out there. Uh, let's not confuse opinion and facts. Uh, we think Willie's going to be here. And uh, we think Willie's going to be here for a long time. And we think he's going to be a career leaf. That's what we think. No. That's what we believe. What else you got? You uh, said yesterday that you had Janssen on Matthews' line. You wanted to give Austin a bit of a softer matchup. And obviously the change today, going on the road, go for Toronto matchup. Have you considered potentially um, working in a home road situation, giving Matthews a bit of a softer matchup at home? Because he was productive, albeit on the power play. but. Well, I and know. then it gives Nazem a, a role too. To yeah. Game. Okay. Um, you know, obviously, we haven't given Nazem much an opportunity with that this year. We think he's real good at it. We thought he did a good job last night against Pavelski's line. Um, we haven't had all hands on deck t to do what we want. But over, uh, once you get rolling, you can experiment with lots of things, and we'll figure all that out. But you're right. Uh, we have a quite a, a road stretch here coming up, and so your road matchups are controlled by the other team, and so you make adjustments accordingly and try to give the team the best chance to win. Uh, 